here is a short video of my ancient warrior settlement. I have my one of my forts in this area with a couple of farms, uh, horses, and some flats. So, and this one has a rye uh, wild plant, so I put a rye in here too. And I have uh, three stables, uh, uh, six stables on most uh, on this side. We have food dryer here and a closer granary and a haystack. So and, uh, no one is starving. Uh, now I have decaying uh, red, so I have to reduce it. And, now traders are coming in like every season and I have to only buy the steel and iron weaponry. Alright, I can buy this. I have a lot of resources to trade. Oh, uh, wow, it's unfortunate that I have only 20 things here. So I have 1,300 and uh, I can, oh, really? I'm short here a little bit. Oh, really? Okay, I'm selling all the steel, uh, other iron whip, uh, tools and weapons, and uh, not the not the, the sickle. Uh, all right, that's one thousand three hundred fifty-six, and we will get some more from here. Oh wow, look at this! I have a lot of this. I'm not using any picks, but I normally buy this and to trade later. So that's okay. And it's winter. I have 245 population. Oh, now we have a raider attack uh, coming from his side. So, okay, this guy, this grandma has to go. Okay, so I built this tent to pre warn me of the incoming raiders. This one has to be 40 something raiders. So once the raider spawn or arrives from that side, I have to disable this side here. And to the other, other fort that will not be involved in the defense. This is this side here. And once they destroy the, the tent here, then I stop the alarm. Okay, I to destroy. That's not bad. My people are not doing anything now, except like... We will speed up a little bit. Now we will see that... You will see that my defenders have breached... Have breached this uh, fort here now. So I'm closing this side here. To avoid just casualties, so I don't know how many casualties I would have been covered, but only on those that are in the platforms. platform because they don't require maintenance and since the population does not rise up to 250 so I don't mind if I lose some villagers on uh, during raid so I think I lost uh, three old people okay my milk and my bread is uh, decaying so I have to limit this one again I'll put it to 30 this one is 15 yeah, I normally don't like this to put be put to infinite, so I will just put it to 50%. And yeah, my water is right there. So it's spring, and I have raw skins, which is at 87, so I have to collect tannin. 
from around from all over the place so look okay my workload is 126 percent it's because they're planting some are repairing and some are collecting tannins i don't collect sticks anymore i think i have i already disabled all sticks work area because i have i can collect a lot of logs and the logs uh, uh, the trees provide me with a lot of sticks uh, this side here i have only four stables because it seems like my animals are not growing so i want my horses and donkeys to grow so i think i'm going to now make two more stables i have to revise this side here and make another two stables i used to have two six stables on this side so it's noticeable when i build my stables i have also my food dryers near them transport post and most important are granaries and stack so i have an excess of 135 straw i can still reduce it by removing all a lot of more a lot of plants a lot of grain plants but i'm just not doing it because it seems like they're not decaying the only problem is that the grains are decaying um, yeah but it doesn't seem like you know see they're not really that going to decay even if it's 900 uh, units and the problem is the the meat which are decaying so i have to trade some of them and uh, look at, i have four granaries here wow it's a lot i can reduce it this but uh, doesn't matter as long as i can maintain them so what's this okay my other fort is here up oh, snow no 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 <laughs> you know when you misclick it's like so dangerous so i have also a uh, storage here for weapons mostly i want two storages here but i cannot you know just make a lot of them i want the storage to be filled with uh, uh, with the animal skins from here so I made uh, this one lately and each fort has its own blacksmith and a workshop and I never have a workshop anymore in my central area so it's like uh, see, I have another weapons and shirts uh, but they don't yeah and every fort must have a roundhouse um, so that every time after the raid they can rest okay so still my log is still a hundred so I don't plan on collecting logs although I can collect logs already so the next raid is coming after one and a half years so look at that my workload is already 26 percent just a little bit after half of the season so i can uh what's this uh rebuild now my fortress here and i only lost one tower which is fine with me because i'm more on preserving my iron production uh, diminishes now it used to be like because I I have to use some uh, uh, bronze, to, uh, bronze tools or whatever I, I buy it from the traders so they bridge uh, they, 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 they damage one uh, gate here which was already uh, having low hit points from the previous raid so this one Look, this is my other fort. I have two stables here. So now, since my uh, uh, what's this? Animals are now increasing. Now my my horses are increasing, and my donkey is increasing. So I have two hundred seventy one. So I need two more stables there. So I have to rebuild this. <laughs> Actually, I just I recently 
restructure these two round houses here. So, oh no, this one doesn't need to go. No, doesn't need to go. No problem with them. So, all right, I look at that. My straw is 130, but I want to reduce it. So I, ha I must, I will just remove a lot of these uh, plants here. Uh, yeah. yeah, there's no point of having this. But, you know, I don't want to waste their planting uh, uh, <laughs> the more. Yeah, wow, look at this. I have another four. And it's nice. I don't like to buy this, but I am. Uh, never mind. Tannin, I need tannin. Oh, actually, yeah, I need tannin. So I have to collect more tannin. So I'm selling a lot of all the bones and a couple of dry skins uh, because I want some leftovers to maintain some of my uh, tents in the outskirts. 617 and this one 672 and this one 7 and resident copper this one. and then I will just add this couple of oh no, no this one I can trade this one I buy and trade you know <laughs> because uh, the it decays when it's in in our possession and they have a new new ones from the trader so I just buy and sell same kind of resources or tools weapons or materials and so yeah if i have a chance i have 91 oh that's good 91 but i still need a lot of tannin if they can collect tannins from here uh, there's no more time excuse me i should have done that earlier right after you know no more so my goal now is to keep on looking for more donkey and horses to tame on oh, this one i have donkey here Yeah, this 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 couple of wolves are like okay. I can count them and then take this too. I have a lot of time during summer because I only plant little pulses. I still have extra seventy five pulses. Wow, that's uh, that's too much of extra. I might reduce my pulses now, or if I want to, I can gather some more uh, logs from here in which I only choose those the oak and the uh, beech trees and because they produce more logs and they produce more logs and uh, sticks so I have 47 cards I try to make like a half or less than half of the total of my horses and donkeys I just put all this uh, hydropower, but normally I don't need them. Every time I have a stud or a granary, I normally try to place a mortar. A mortar is enough already for every granary, and it does. And uh, every granary, I must have a herd at least, because if I need some bread, then then I can produce bread easily. I don't need. I never. I think I never make a. Uh, what is an omen in this uh, in this, in this uh, game so here is my central uh, settlement and I have uh, this stockpile of metals uh, metals you know? I provided two over here since they are also placing rose skins here so I make a couple of tanners over here too uh, I only retain two bloomeries, one metal smith, and one pit furnace. This one is seldom used because normally, oh wow, fifteen. I should not. I should have limited it to ten. Yeah, it's ten. But why is he making? You're not supposed to be making. Oh boy. <laughs>
Oh yeah, I still have another workshop here which produces some. So this is my settlement. Once they finish, they gather everything. I rebuild this tent over here to give me an early warning again next time the raid comes. Yep. Mm -hmm, sorry. So this is it. This is my settlement. No starvation. Look at that. It's more greener. Uh, I don't like those uh, gulag type of settlement. And thank you for watching. And I hope you guys uh, will. Yeah.